Only on NBC5 News, a comprehensive study will soon be taking place on water in the Rogue Valley. We filed a public records request for all water quality tests done since 2013. We've yet to receive those records. But tonight in an NBC5 News investigation, we've learned that lead was recently found in old connection pipes. We're going to correct it. That's what we do. Medford Water Commission Chair Lee Johnson says staff and management recently found lead pigtails within older Medford neighborhoods. Those pigtails, as we understand it, were probably in the system beginning 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80 years ago with no records. According to Johnson, those pigtail pipes connect the main lines to meters. They've since been replaced, but the recent findings have prompted the commission to do a large-scale study of the whole system, which he says hasn't been done in over 30 years. We have complied with everything the EPA has ever asked that we do, uh, but our test sites uh, could be expanded. A 2015 water quality report showed all but one residence tested for lead were well below the 15 parts per billion requirement by the EPA. However, the Water Commission's most recent tests, done in Medford, Eagle Point, and Jacksonville, were back in 2013. As for the most recent traces of lead in the pigtail pipes. Were those tests, were they within the 15 parts per no, billion? No, they, they were, well, probably not. I don't know, I don't know that we have the information on what they tested for, but they had lead. It wouldn't make any difference what they are. If they have lead, they're going to be gone. Johnson says they'll be putting out a request for proposal for the study in the next couple of weeks, but when asked about public safety, should the public be concerned? No, I don't believe so because we've been testing right along, you know, all the time that we're required to, and the areas that we test show we're in total compliance. A spokesperson for the Medford Water Commission says they have replaced the lead pigtails as they found them. In a statement, they say in part, quote, while we don't have precise locations, it is currently believed that homes built after 1950 are unlikely to have service lines with pigtails. I'm told where pigtails have been found, they did not test the homes to see if lead was present and say it's possible lead could have gotten into their water. We'll have much more on this ongoing investigation tomorrow night right here on NBC5 News at 6.